let's set up devpy server for a pypy mirror and cache. We'll make a virtual environment. Activate the virtual environment. From here, we'll use pip to install the devpy server. Check the version. Initialize the devpy server. Create a configuration to run devpy in the background. Start supervisor D with the config. So it looks like devpy server is listening on port 3141. Let's use it from another project. We'll make another virtual environment here. Activate the virtual environment. Use the new devpy server URL. And since that was the first time that I've used devpy server on this laptop, uh, it had to go out to PyPy to get it.